Hey, what's up, Cartes T-shirt, riches.com. So, got a topic I want to talk about. Probably a lot of y'all, I get this every day. Um, hundreds, hundreds of this particular issue is a problem. But a guy emailed me on Facebook the other day, well, messaged me on Facebook. And I normally don't engage folks that come through me through Messenger um, and who's not a member because the conversations always end up the same way. Everybody got a story about how they wanted to start a t-shirt business. Um, and, and everybody's story is unique. Everybody's story is different. Everybody's situation is, 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 is a legitimate excuse to them. And this guy um, said he found my site some years ago and it was his dream since he was a young uh, teenager uh, to start his own t-shirt business. And now I'm thinking he's like in his 30s now because he, he mentioned a lot of years that passed by. And he talked about how he wanted to do it so bad. And then years passed by now he's at a job that he absolutely hates with a passion, um, makes good money, and, 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 and has time off from work to do other things. And I was like, so why, why, what, what's the deal? Why, why haven't you started? Well... I don't know what to do. I'm like, dude, with all the stuff that's online, you still stuck at, you don't know what to do. And so he started making excuses. Well, life got in the way. No, life ain't got in the way. Um, talking about his family, thought it was a bad idea. And that's really what it was for him. We, we as people, we have, we get in our own way. It's, there's nobody stopping you from doing this. You yourself, is, is, is the problem. Our, this entrepreneurship is a mental game. It's a head game. And if your mental game ain't right, you just ain't going to be successful. It's going to be so much harder to make this work. You got to get out of your way with excuses and start making choices that benefit you in the short run and in the long run. You just got to make the better choice because you're making choices every day like his choice not to do anything for a few years after he came across the resources and, and material that he found online, he specifically chose not to do anything. And here he is two to three years later in the same position and, and making the same excuses and just telling me a whole sob story about why he didn't start. And so I pressed him and pressed him and said, so at the end of the day, man, what's stopping you from doing it now? And he said, well, I don't know what to do. I said, you know what? Buy, the, buy my course. It buy my course is on sale, and it'll tell you exactly what to do. So we had this conversation. We went back for a few hours, and then when I told him that, he went ghost. So I, call, I followed up with him the next day, sent him a message. I said, so what's up, man? What you going to do? Just like that. And then he replied back, oh, uh, uh, I'm at work and my schedule's busy right now and I got things to do and, and I'll revisit it later, which is his way of saying he'll revisit it again in a couple of years, whining and complaining and making excuses about why. So what are you going to do? Because at the end of the day, you just got to start at some point. Nobody is going to um, give you permission. Nobody's going to approve your decision. Um, you just got to do it, man. You just got to do it. And I promise you, if you take the first step, it's going to open up a world beyond your imagination. It's like a lot of folks are scared to go up the road and see what's around the corner. But at least if you take the first few steps and get to that stop sign, you can look left, you can look, you can look left, you can look right, you can look straight ahead and make a decision on which path you're going to take. But you're not going to make either turn until you get up there and see what's up there. So many things and opportunities have happened just because I took the first step. And that step took me in a, in a different direction entirely. Directions that I would have, have, would have been unknown to me um, because I, I wasn't looking for those opportunities. I hadn't even considered those opportunities as a possibility. But because I took the first step... Doors were opened, opportunities were opened, money came flowing, and, and that's it. You just got to make a decision to do this, and you got to stay focused. You got to stay disciplined. There is no secret to making this work 
other than staying focused long enough to get it going and being disciplined to stay the course even when things don't look like they're going in the right direction. You got to take the leap at some point. Your spouse ain't going to just wake up one day and say, honey, today is a great day to start a t-shirt. But no, honey, it's a great day to fulfill that lifetime dream you had of being an entrepreneur. No, that ain't going to happen. But it can happen today if you decide. The choice is yours. The decision is yours. The decision to do absolutely nothing and just sit there and think and daydream about it, it's, it's your choice. You, you making one and it's yours to own. It's nobody holding you back. And to get started, I mean, I, I, you know, and I'm talking about my course because it's a blueprint. I've already been down that road and can shortcut your path and save you a lot of frustration, save you a lot of headache, save you a ton of money by giving you a blueprint. Why not take it? Just, just do it. Take the first step. There is no excuse. You can't sit here and say you don't know what to do. Cause that's not even, that's, it's, it's absurd at this stage. Make a decision and take action. That is the secret, my friends. So I just wanted to share that because I get it every single day and it's starting to annoy me. Nobody is holding you back and stopping you but yourself, because most of you go out to eat on a regular basis. You go out and buy stuff from your favorite electronic store. A lot of y'all went out there and bought a big screen TV to watch the Super Bowl when you could be sitting down at that table writing, writing out a business plan for changing your life. And your family is depending on you to make some good choices. So start making choices that benefit you tomorrow and benefit you in the future, because making the same choices you've been making it's going to continue to keep you where you're at now. So it's time to make new choices so that tomorrow will have will yield a different result. So I'm Cartes Ross with T-Shirt Riches. Just wanted to get that off my chest and hopefully, hopefully put a fire up on somebody to, to get out there and do something. Thanks for watching.